their first strike at each other shocked the entire arena. Kengan Ashura Season 2 is finally been released and comes the time for the best fights of the tournament. Tokita Oma, after his gruesome fight against Ryan, tries to convince everyone that he is fine, but suddenly loses consciousness and remembers his childhood, how he met Nico for the first time and how he started to train. But while Oma is in a coma, the tournament continues and even without the main character of the series, fights are going to be epic. Two huge monsters face each other in the ring. Wakatsuki Takeshi, a man who was different from the moment he was born, having a birth weight of 12,150 grams due to his body's abnormally high muscle density. He was unable to live a normal life because of uh, his condition and lived inside a secret laboratory until uh, the age of 7, when his future employer Furumi Heihachi helped him learn to regulate his strength by encouraging him to punch him as hard as he could. What a mistake. Wakatsuki has had the longest career out of any Kengan Association fighters, winning a total of 306 matches and earning over 3 trillion yen for Furumi Pharmaceuticals prior to the Kengan Annihilation Tournament. However, he has lost twice, once to Hatsumi Ten and once to Kano Agito. His loss to Kano 8 years ago resulted in an injured ankle that never completely healed and remains quite literally his Achilles heel to this day. Ever since then, Takeshi has been waiting for a chance to get his revenge against Kano, though the monster with a height of 193 cm and weight of 193 kg, who was born to be a monster, faced another huge creature who was made by science, Julius Reinhold. Julius has extremely developed muscles derived in part from special doping, having taken enough steroids to kill an average man. Uh, shout out to Jack Hanma. His immense muscular structure grants him colossal physical strength, durability and destructive power, as shown when remained unmoved and even pulled against an uh, F1-raced car that was trying to yank him away as well as easily snapping the special ordered chains wrapped around his body. Julius studied sports physiology, sports medicine, psychology and even physics. His combination of uh, biological knowledge and physical strength makes him an extremely dangerous combatant. So two biggest dudes in the tournament meet each other in the ring. Their first strike at each other shocked the entire arena. But despite closely matching Julius in a battle of full powered punches, Wakatsuki was put on the back foot due to Julius' impressive durability. As a result, Takeshi was forced to use Blast Core, a powerful punch that involves compressing all of his muscles to a single point in the center of his body and then unleashing it, heightening Julius' caution and forcing him to keep his distance. However, Julius noticed Blast Core's weakness and uh, countered Takeshi's next Blast Core with the Bear Hug. 
But Wakatsuki once again used his signature technique to break Julius' bear hug by compressing his muscles, which allowed him to explode his way out of the hold. Julius inflicted a particularly savage chain of attacks upon Takeshi, including dragging his face across the arena wall. Almost done, Takeshi decides to use his blast core move once again, but only to distract Julius before knocking him out with a furious kick to the head. After the fight, in spite of his super injuries, Takeshi reflected that the biggest loss was that uh, the other fighters, including Kano Agito, had seen his blast core, making it ineffective as an ace in the hole. And also, his injured ankle was damaged hardly after using blast core, so for his next fight, he won't be completely ready in terms of physical capabilities. But anyway, every participant uh, who made his way through the second round is terribly damaged, so they should be under the same conditions. What do you think about the first fight of the new season? I already forgot how cool the fights are in Kengan Ashura and how not annoying the talkings during the fights are. Not like in Bucky, where I want everyone to shut up. In Kengan, the tokens are just on point, and I enjoyed every single one of the fights. <laughs> What do you think about the new season? Leave your comments down below. Subscribe for not to miss new videos about other fights. Leave a like if this video was interesting to you. Ring the bell for not to miss the new video. Thank you all for watching. For now, I'm out. Bye. Take the girls with their nails done now.